Dozens of police have gathered in Melbourne's north where a controversial right-wing commentator is due to start her speaking tour. Mark Santamartino's in Somerton. Now, Mark, officers are on high alert for violence. After the savage brawl which broke out at the front of Milo Yiannopoulos' speaking tour around six months ago, Pete, police aren't taking any chances. There are dozens of officers either from the Mounted Branch or in riot squad gear here at the La Mirage reception venue, which was the secret venue for Canadian YouTuber Lauren Southerns speaking to it a kick-off in Australia tonight. There are even more police down at the Broadmeadows train station where ticket holders are currently boarding buses to come to this secret venue. Around 50 protesters are already there chanting abuse at ticket holders as they board those shuttle buses police managing to keep them at bay however it is understood they're going to be making their way here to la mirage very very shortly as i mentioned this is all in the name of canadian youtuber lauren southern she's that 23 year old internet agitator known or well, is infamous for being booted out of the uk after posting rainbow colored signs with the slogan allah is gay on them she's anti-islamist anti-multiculturalism and anti-feminist in fact last night she told a current affair that women aren't psychologically developed to be CEOs. Their opinions that apparently people are paying up to $750 to hear as she kicks off her speaking tour tonight. We know she arrived in Melbourne ready to provoke last week wearing a t-shirt that said it's okay to be white. In the past couple of days she's also posted a video to her YouTube channel of her going undercover on the streets of Melbourne and asking people whether she should be killed for the views that she holds. Now apparently that's something she's quite worried about because the amount of security which has been following her since she arrived in Australia has been profound. It must cost her a lot of money along with what Victoria Police is providing in terms of protection tonight. There are reports that that's costing her up to $67,000 just to keep the peace, Pete, not only at Broadmeadows train station but when those protesters are expected to arrive here shortly.